Yo, so it's time for another bootleg reaction video. Um, not gonna fuck about this time, gonna just do it from home. And rather than fuck around with microphones and trying to mix it all together and be too clever, um, I'm gonna go proper, proper chavy bootleg with this and just film with all my iPads. And I'll just use my phone as a, oh, where are we gonna go? We'll go, go somewhere around here or whatever. I'll use my phone as a second screen. That way I'm not distracted from um, the video, I can just listen to the music and get a fresh take on it, all right? Um, what well, might help if I tell you guys who I'm doing this week. So this week I'm doing the band Bury Your Gun, or Bury the Gun. I should have researched that before, I do, before doing this. Bury the Gun. Yeah, Bury the Gun. Sorry, Charlie. Um, I've not come into this prepared. Um, I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. That's the whole like, that's the whole setup of these bootleg videos, right? I'm gonna be straight with you guys. I'm not gonna try to be funny. I'm not gonna try to be comedic. I'm not gonna try to edit or cut things together to try and try and be something I'm not. All right. I am just a divvy chav uh, who loves metal, um, and I like doing stupid shit like this. So, look, if you enjoy it, you enjoy it. If you don't, whatever, man, get on with your life. Go away. Right. So where is it? Do you know what, man? It's got some fucking next round for no reason. Bury the gun. So, bury the gun. They're a local band. Um, I know a few of the guys, a few guys in the band, but it's not about that. It's not about me wagging my tail and showing off uh, people I know. Because um, really, it's just a testament to how sad I am. I need people, lots of people in my life at all times. I need fresh things to play with. Yeah, that's a bit much. Um, bury the gun, breaking. Yeah, cool. Bury the gun, breaking. Uh, opening YouTube. Do you know what, at this point, I'm saying to myself, I should start this video again. Um, but do you know what, I'm gonna just roll with it. I'm gonna just roll with it, all right? So um, this is Bury the Gun, uh, the latest single, Breaking. I recently rebranded the logo and done some bits with them, but I've not released anything for that yet because, well, you don't need to fucking know why. It's not released it yet, get over it. Um, this is Bury the Gun, Breaking. Right, volume's up. Right, how are we gonna do this? Oh, sorry, man. Already, man, digging this. Um, instantly, you're off the top of my head. It's like throw me back to being 15 years old, Queens of the Stone Age, um, WKD in my hand, sort of. Um, that's my earliest memory for that sort of rock stuff because, yeah, again, I am just, I literally am just a chav um, who's tried to sort of decorate myself over life to not look like a chav, but that's what I am. Um, <clears throat> yeah, digging it, man, loving the rock vibes. Um, loving the screw face, like it's making me want to just, <clears throat> yeah, right, shush. Oh. Yeah, turn this off first. Charlie, man, your voice is sick. Oh man, I wish, I wish I could make my voice that smoky. Do that notification. Bootleg. Okay, what I do that. Yeah, man. Oh man, tidy. The visuals are cool as well, man. You guys have a lot of fun with them, I can tell.
Bring it down. Some very proggy, man. Loving it. Love that, man. Like, that really energetic setup to begin with, um, making me sort of want to get involved with it. And then taking me, like, this whole sort of upbeat journey, that smoky voice, like, really, really keeping me centered. Um, then, boom, bringing it down. Into this right, really nice, like proggy bit where I've really, I got lost. Like, I don't know if you saw me reach, I reached to go pick up a cigarette and spark it because I sort of, I got lost in that moment. Um, um, yeah, I don't, I don't know why I'm getting my cigarette now. Um, yeah, cool. Right, let's see where it's going. Let's see where this is going. Yeah, man, I can really hear like Velvet Revolver, like Guns N' Roses sort of energy in there. Like, I really, they're really sort of misunderstood, like, flat and um, flash, slash, like, tone and energy. Oh man, you guys are naughty. Yeah, you guys are loving this song, man. This must have been so much fun to record in the video for. <laughs> oh shit! Yes! I don't know why, right? I know it's frightening the song, I should just fucking let it carry on, what a dickhead, but. Um, that last little bit, for some reason, took me back to like a banana bunch, um, like Sunday morning cartoon, like Hanna Barbera, like, mm -mm, like yeah, that's where my mind went to, went to, meant to. That's where my mind went to. Doesn't mean like it means anything. It's just I love cartoons and shit. Yeah, that's what made me think of. Boo leg a f. It cut out. It cut out before I could finish the video. So I've gone back a little bit so I didn't interrupt the ending like I did uh, last time. Um, so yeah, the end of Bury, Bury the Gun Breaking. It's a cool little video, guys. You have to let me know where you film that, like, privately, like, drop me a message, let me know the location, because I'd love to do some shooting stuff there, that's, that's it, guys. Um, when I say shooting, I don't mean, like, shooting people, I mean, like, videos and cameras and stuff and that, like, not that I look gangster or sound gangster, so you guys wouldn't have speculated it to be that to begin with. But talk about speculation, uh, I'm not going to speculate as to what the narrative of the video was, because I wasn't really paying attention, um, I really was trying to lose myself in the song, 
Um, that's why I was pulling stupid faces and shit. Um, guys, you've done a good job. I really enjoyed that. Um, I, I had just as much fun watching and listening to that as you guys would on filming, um, which I think that's what you're trying to get across. Uh, on a second listen, I'll pay more attention to the lyrics and the content. Um, but yeah, guys, first impression, smashed it. Like, cool. Um, keep it up and look forward to uh, hearing more of your content and shit and look forward to reviewing it, all right? Take it easy, guys. Hope you guys hope you're all staying safe in lockdown. That was almost a good ending, wasn't it?